What's up guys, Austin Nerd Joe here and today we're unboxing the BAM box for this month. So we actually got this one uh, relatively early compared to when we normally get them. So let's go ahead and check it out and see what we've got in here. So we got our paper as usual. Okay, so this is a little bit weird stuff going on in here. So we did get a 1-up item, so we have a red 1-up, so we'll get something increased of some sort. And hopefully they have a thing telling us what it is. We'll go ahead and start with this. I have no clue what it is, but it looks, it's really heavy whatever it is. So we have this. I have absolutely no clue what this is at all. It looks like a little piece of something. I don't know what it's supposed to be at all. I've never seen this. Don't know anything about this at all. I assume it's supposed to be a prop from something, but I have absolutely no clue. But I did see there is a paper in here, so we will be able to see what it is. Then next up here, it looks like we have possibly a necklace of some sort. So it looks like a coin, kind of like we've gotten in the past. Like an old timey coin, but it's on a necklace here, so you can see we have the chain, and then we have just that. So that's what's on there. Of course, it's in something else, so it can't see it or read it or anything. So I have no clue what that is, and on the back, it's just like detailed in coins. So it's supposed to be like an old coin or something, you know, that's made from like some sort of metal that they've engraved stuff onto. But other than that, again, I have no clue what this is at all. Uh, then next up, we have our pin for the month, and so we got a Slimer pin there. And so, this, of course, the name is Ghostbusters, and then, so this is limited, so this may be our um, rare item, because it says only 99 made, so this may be our one-up item, I don't really know for sure, but we do have a Slimer pin there. And then next up, we got some pictures, so first off here, we have an Avengers picture, which looks really cool, so of course, we're getting ready for the um, Avengers Infinity War movie to come out soon, so we have this picture here. So, of course, we have Thanos there in the back, a Thor, Hulk, uh, Captain America, Iron Man, and then Hawkeye, Black Widow, and uh, Nick Fury there at the bottom. And then it says it is signed by the person. So this we've had this guy before. It says original um, box of, of Infinity War 1 of 3. So it looks like you could have got three different pictures. And it's Logan Pack as the artist there. Which again we have got stuff from him in the past. So I really like that picture a lot. It looks really cool. And then our last picture for the month is. Oh this is cool. A Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles picture. So it's just like a print of the Ninja Turtles. You know the old 80's version. A logo and characters there. And it is signed. And so we have a card here on the back that says. Um, a sign of, or photo of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles has been hand signed by Greg Berg who voices Donatello and Bebop in the cartoon, which is really cool because Donatello is my favorite out of all the turtles. And I didn't know that he did both Donatello and Bebop, so that's really cool. And of course there's a picture of the guy that did it back there. It's hard to see, but I really like that picture a lot. That is cool. And so that is it for all of the items out of the box, but we did get just a weird piece of paper here that has the items. Um, so it looks like we may be missing something. I don't know, because it says something about a Lone Star Birthright pin. Oh, maybe this? I don't know. It says Lone Star's Birthright Pendant space from Spaceballs. I don't know what, what's supposed to be. It might be the necklace. The necklace? I don't know. It doesn't look very Spaceballsy if it is. That's what that's supposed to be. I don't know for sure. But yeah, it's something from Spaceballs. Uh, then we got our um, Infinity War poster. Um, it shows two, on here it says two of three, so I don't know what the whole thing, because this one says one of three, but it shows Infinity War print two of three, but I don't know what that whole deal is supposed to be, so I assume there would be three different pictures and you could got one of any of three, but it does not show exactly. Um, then we have the Turtles picture here. It says Greg Berg signed photo, Funkos, and DVDs. So we got the photo. So apparently there must have been multiple different options you could have got. But we got a photo, which of course the pop would have been cool. Or I don't know what the DVD would have been. Um, but it would have been nice to see what it was. Um, then next up we have our Ghostbusters. It says fan art pin. Again by the same artist of Logan Pack as the picture. So we have that um, as well. It doesn't say anything about rare or exclusive because it's just labeled. Um, I don't know if this there are multiple. It doesn't say. It just says Ghostbusters pin. Um, but we have the Slimer one there that does say only 99 made, so it does seem more rare. But, of course, this doesn't say anything about it. And the last thing, which um, I still don't recognize or remember this at all, but from seeing this is kind of cool. So it says a data storage unit replica from Star Wars and has a little picture of R2-D2. So I don't know what that's supposed to be, if this is maybe supposed to be... Um, I don't know. I don't recognize this at all. I've watched a lot of Star Wars and I don't recognize this at all. I wonder if that's that missing piece that BB-8 was carrying around. Uh, it could be, I guess. 
I haven't watched The Force Awakens enough that closely to recognize this, but it would be cool if, like, because the, the way it's designed and shaped, if you got two of them, if they maybe, like, sit together or something would be cool. But I don't know. I, it doesn't look familiar at all to me. But um, since it is from Star Wars, I guess that's kind of cool, but without knowing that, I would have no clue what that is. So that's it for the box. Again, I don't know why we got one up if it was the Slimer thing, since it does say more rare, but that's the only hint I can get from that. So I don't know exactly. But that's going to be it for this BAM box unboxing for this month. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to see more unboxings, and we'll see you next time.